occupied! <laughs> you made the ice cream angry! I called the professor, and he's on his way. Like, who is this guy again? Professor Higginson? Why, he wrote the book on Winter Hollow's ghost. Works up at that college in Mills Corner. Well, Asa, it looks like you got your way after all. Eh, nah, check us in. You can't stay in a freezing cold house. Now, nah, don't be that way, Mortimer. You know at Christmas time, it's safer for everyone to move in here for a while. Can we celebrate, you know what, here? We'll sure try, son. Asa, the key? Oh, this is awful. Seems like half the town's moved in since that headless horror showed up. Asa's business is booming. I wonder. Asa, where is it? Where's the headless snowman? Take me there immediately. Ah, uh, Professor Higginson, these are the kids I told you about. Thanks for coming so quickly, Professor. Well, it's not that far to Mills Connors University. Besides, I'd travel hundreds of miles to see the actual ghost of Blackjack Brody. Like who? Who? Blackjack Brody. Legend has it, he's the Headless Snowman. That's right. But the legend of the Headless Snowman really starts Christmas Eve, 1823, when this man, Seamus Fagan, rode into Winter Hollow. He had just immigrated from the old country with a fortune in gold. Sadly, Seamus Fagan wasn't the only one on that desolate road. For Blackjack Brody, the infamous highwayman, was laying in wait to rob any helpless wayward traveler. Did he get away with it? He got away with the gold, but he didn't exactly get away. The villagers formed a posse. For days, they searched every nook and cranny of Winter Hollow. Did they ever catch him? No, it was the blizzard that caught Blackjack Brody. What happened? When they dug him out of that snowman, he was completely covered in chimney soot. Wow. What happened to the gold? Never found. Legend has it that Blackjack Brody yearns for it still. His ghost forever trapped in that frozen tomb of a snowman. It's more than a legend. That frosty freak just demolished most of little Tommy's house. Someone or something doesn't want us to be here. But why? What are they protecting? Of course, one of the original Winter Hollow homes. That's the oldest house in town. Except maybe Jeb's. Well, I must check out Tommy's house right away.